in second grade. <laughs> Minded on African Culture Day. <laughs> Mr. Table Topics Master, fellow Toastmasters, and most elaborately costumed guests. <laughs> when I was in second grade, my school decided to celebrate African Culture Day. We were going to learn African folklore. We were going to sing African songs. We were going to prepare African food. And we were going to do a presentation for our friends and family. In preparation for this, we were supposed to research African costumes and put something together that we could wear on African Culture Day. As you can tell, I never turned down a good costume party. <laughs> so I researched, and I got sandals, and I got a sarong, and I got beads for both arms. I got a turban. I don't know if a turban was precisely accurate, but I had to cover up the blonde hair somehow. So I had a turban. I showed up to school looking like the pastiest little African thing. What I had missed was the part of the instructions where they told us that costumes were optional. <laughs> I was the only kid in second grade who showed up on African Culture Day dressed as something even remotely African. <laughs> so I learned a few things that day. One, that kids are cruel. <laughs> Two, that you have to be able to laugh at yourself. And three, that it's always okay to be overdressed. <laughs> and that was my defining moment. <laughs>